hey, how's it going? I just wanted to film this really short video for you just to really explain to you like really how a webinar funnel can really increase your sales dramatically over time as well as being very, very resistant to add costs. And so if you're really selling anything that's high ticket uh, product or service to a customer where the sales cycle is actually very, very long and requires um, uh, a lot of persuasion, a lot of really understanding and education of the product, right? The webinar funnel is probably... Um, your most potent form of acquisition channel that you can use. And let me just explain to you exactly how it operates, how the entire machinery works, right? And stuff and the technology behind it. So you can really understand uh, how it can really bring value to your business. All right. So let me just show you. Okay. So on the left hand side, as you can see here, like it doesn't matter what the traffic source is, but I'm just putting YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, right? So imagine you're running ads to an opt-in page. I'm going to show you exactly even what I'm running. On, on, on my side, on my business as well, I'll show you different examples of other people running as well. Okay, so for example, all of these traffic sources actually go onto opt-in, and right, so the opt-in people, uh, you're giving exchange for value, right? So you're showing them something or educating them uh, about the product and stuff, right? So they give you your email address, and basically the email address goes through a very, very long sequence, and so imagine once you get this email address, right, you can literally advertise them to, uh, for free for forever. Right, so as long as you're continuously giving them value and educating them about the product, showing that different people have used the product uh, to successfully to get results as well, and so this is a very very long uh, process as well. So you can literally do like literally sixty emails stretch over three day intervals. You literally have hundred eighty days. You can really educate the prospect about it, and uh, so you also can pump that into retargeting ads. So you're being very very aggressive and shortening the sales cycle as well. All right, so. After they opt-in, they basically come onto a, a video sales letter. And this video sales letter has a template, right? It has a formula. It's just um, squashing common objections that your customer probably has, right? Uh, the, the, the common objections that they have, uh, number one. Uh, number two, they are also, uh, you're showing them the products or the features, the benefits, right, of the product and service and educating them about how it's going to help them, how is it going to get their results, uh, help them make more money, uh, save money, or whatever it is, right? So this is very important because this conversion asset, this is an asset, by the way, is resistant to add costs. Once you get this opt-in page, right, you basically can send people to this page forever and forever. And the, the conversion happens here, not here, right? You don't have to convince people on the traffic sources, which you cannot control. You actually convince people on the sales video. And that is why it's so, so powerful. All right. And then afterwards, the sales video, right, it comes into probably, uh, it can be a type form. It can be an equity scheduling. So they actually can book a call with you and they'll select a time and they'll go into an online meeting or a phone, right? So basically, if you're selling anything over the phone or you need to close uh, someone, um, to, to see someone, right, basically meeting wise, right, then you can use a webinar funnel and it's very, very strong. Okay, so um, the best thing about it is that because people, if you use a type form or a jot form, right, for example, right, people are keying in the information, their form fields right there, people are putting in their information. So they're showing incredible purchase intent right there. And they're also showing you that they are very, very qualified leads in the first place because nobody, uh, people, people who are actually interested will take the time to fill out the form. And so you're actually dealing with the 80-20 principle right there. You can focus on leads that actually want to be close, want to buy your product or service. All right. So that's really, very good. Um, afterwards, uh, the email, you can send them to, for example, more content, more videos, uh, more blog posts, whatever it is, whatever you want to show them, testimonials, right? And then you, you also can show them to a webinar replay, right? And then the webinar replay can come back to a job form, to a calendar a calendar booking page, and people can book on your calendar as well, right? And this comes into an online meeting, all right? So let me show you exactly uh, what I'm running on my backend as well. So really it's being transparent, right? So for example, this is my opt-in page. This is my opt-in page right here. And so this is my offer. So this is offer or headline, right? Is really definitely uh, tailored towards your business. This is something that uh, you definitely need to be, uh, it needs to be a hook. Uh, the hook needs to be very, very attractive, right? So uh, in here, I'm kind of selling it. How do I help uh, high ticket lead businesses from losing money to really scaling aggressively and uh, profiting a lot, right? So that's my hook. And that's why people want to know what this information. And so they will opt in, right? Same for your business. Think about um, how you can really hook people into your audience and really sell them on what is it you want to sell. All right, so uh, they'll come in here, put in their email address, and then they'll press opt-in. And basically, they come into uh, the backend right here. So this is basically uh, my value sale, uh, VSL, right? My, my video sales letter right here, right? And this conversion asset right here, uh, we definitely, uh, when you work with us, right, we will literally give you uh, the templates, uh, the formula. So you just need to plug and play in your business. And we need to uh, talk, I guess, just to uh, tweak the messaging as well as to make sure uh, that uh, you are showing the audience, educating the audience, as well as uh, squashing any common objections that they have. So that's basically how the value video works. And then afterwards, there is a call to action, a very defined call to action so that it prompts people to go book a discovery call or go prompts people to uh, complete the form with you. 
So you can use either or. So let me show you what I'm using. I'm just using uh, equity scheduling right here. So this is my thank you page in a sense, right? And this, uh, once people actually book a call, right, then the conversion pixel will fire and then uh, I can track people from there as well. Okay, so everything is data driven right here. So uh, my one is just uh, people will book a call, for example. So you can see discovery call and then a time zone or whatever. And then people can select a time right? So that's happening behind, or you also can use a type form, right? So a type form kind of looks like this and people have to fill out forms, right? So if people actually fill out forms, it really shows incredible purchase intent because nobody spent the time to actually fill up a form if they are not interested in buying a service, right? So you know that if you have SDRs, uh, su uh, support dev reps, or you have people who are salespeople, right? Who are qualifying leads and stuff, this um, a very, very a adv big advantage is that you already have pre-qualified leads coming to you. So you have incredible leverage when you are closing the deals. All right. So that's uh, one thing, right? Another, I'll show you another example of another company or business that's running the exact same thing, right? It's just um, think about it as uh, the technology is ag agnostic, right? You just don't think about the technology must really focus on the messaging and the offer, right? Don't worry about the technology too much, right? So for example, this one, uh, they're selling uh, marketing services uh, for SaaS companies. So uh, for example, this is offer and this is running on ClickFunnels, by the way. So they opt in right here and then come into a sales video. Right. This sales video is loading right here. And so this is around a 30 minute sales video. And then to get a price, to get a price um, they will book onto a Calendly uh, booking call. So as you can see, the webinar funnel exists in different ways. It's just that uh, it doesn't matter what the tech stack is. Once again, it's, sorry, it's important uh, that you basically have your offer down and basically you're selling to the audience and ensure that the messaging is very, very tight, right? The best thing about it is that, uh, for example, here you can see, right, I'm using Wistia. Why do I use Wistia? It's because I can track the analytics behind it. I can literally see the drop off in traffic of when people are watching my videos and when people are not watching, right? So if you can see, and we are driving traffic towards, um, towards this video, right? We can see on the back end, uh, for example, if there's a lot of drop off in traffic, we know that at a certain point in time, we need to change offer. We need to change the messaging, uh, change the copy basically, right? And, and the speech and who is talking on, on the video as well. Okay. So it's very, very powerful because everything is data driven and everything is measurable, measurable, sorry. Yeah. So let me just reiterate the advantages of a webinar funnel. It's fully automated. Qualified leads actually come to you. You actually reduce load on the SDR team or people who need to pre-qualify. You can grow your brand and scale and then uh, less churn when people use the product because you're actually educating people on the product on the webinar already. So there's less churn, right? People understand uh, the value proposition. Yep. And it's suitable for selling high ticket. So, <coughs> So um, as you can see this, the entire uh, funnel being mapped out, I'm just gonna be very, very brief right here. So traffic, uh, landing page opt-in, uh, value sales video, it could be a type form, whatever it is, right? It goes in your CMS and then you can book a call uh, with your sales team, blah, 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 all right? Um, another thing is that, okay, let me just stop this, all right? So they're actually, sorry, um, everything is uh, proven by math, okay? So this is literally a calculator that we have, uh, we have created. So for example, if the maximum I'm willing to pay if I'm being very, very worst case scenario sort of thing, right? Is that uh, the cost per discovery call, right? The cost you're paying for someone to come on a call with you is $200. For example, you can see here, the ROAS, the, the ROI is still profitable channel. If I'm selling uh, a product or package for 50, uh, 1500 and the conversion rate is 30%, right? So for example, if you want to set KPIs and you want to set uh, worst case scenarios, this is how we really optimize. And then as you can see, um, you can put $75 in and then you can uh, run, run the numbers and then you can see whether you are profitable or not. Right, so you can really uh, ensure that before you start any uh, running and traf any traffic towards a page, you know exactly uh, what you are doing. All right. Um, yep. So that's about it. Um, I want to show you this one as well. Like proven companies that actually run webinar funnels. Right. I'm just not uh, talking for the sake of talking. Right. So for example, here Tesla runs a webinar funnel. Okay. Uh, to be fair, they are Tesla. Right. So. Um, ran $14 billion in a product launch. So this is opt-in page, this is the webinar page, and then this is the order page where people deposit $1,000. Second one, uh, Demio. So Demio is a webinar sales software, same thing. So thank you page, right? And then these are their email sequences. All right, third one would be Intercom. Intercom is a massive uh, support um, support SaaS. Basically, as you can see here, webinar, thank you registration page. Uh, this one is their actual video that they're selling to, and then then their email sequences come up as well. All right, next example. Next example, auto grow, auto grow, same thing. Uh, as you can see here, right, the webinar, and then they sell a package afterwards. And then so basically the conversion pixel is, uh, uh, you can fire right here and you can actually track the conversions. All right, number six, number six uh, would be email marketing software, uh, Market Hero. So they do the same thing. Uh, they have a webinar opt-in page and stuff. And then afterwards they have a sales page right here. 
All right, so as you can see, like the webinar funnel, it exists in many, many different forms. So don't worry too much about the technology stack. Worry about um, how do I treat my customer the right way? How do I actually convince my customer to buy my product? Why does my customer need it, right? Uh, really tweak and really like niche down on your messaging because by really talking to everybody, you're talking to nobody, right? And so by being very, very specific, right, you're really getting the leads that you want and actually very, very qualified leads that you can even really close in, making your business a, a ton, a ton much easier as well. Right, so as you can see here, I really hope this gives you a perspective on what an entire webinar funnel looks like and what it potentially could do for your business, right? Because this could be really the main acquisition channel for you to really scale very profitably and you only need one funnel. You only need one thing uh, to, to work out, right? So um, by running this, having the conversion assets in it, you're compounding over time and the ROI that you see from your webinar funnel will actually increase over time. And the reason is that is because the more people you have on your email list, the more people who are warm leads who, but who have not booked a call, right? You can just continuously retarget that warm traffic audience as it becomes bigger. Does that make sense? Yeah, it keeps getting bigger. The, the ROAS will just increase over time. And basically, you just dominate everyone in the marketplace. And that is why it's so powerful. And that's why, uh, yeah, I, I can't say much enough. Okay, uh, I hope this kind of um, gives you more perspective on what the entire webinar funnel looks like. And if you work with us, um, then um, yeah, we definitely give you the scripts, give you the SOP, literally everything. You just need to plug and play. And then we can help you run uh, the traffic through it as well. All right, so um, thank you for watching uh, this video. I hope it gives you more perspective. And yeah, if you want to find me, you can find me at osg-media.com and then we can kind of like set up this entire thing for you. And yeah, it'll be, it'll be really great because it, it works. All right, okay, see you soon.